Hello and welcome to a demonstration of the Enhanced Flex ID product by Magic Lamp Software Solutions. My name is Matthew Burke and today I'll be explaining to you the new functionalities that will help reduce the number of actions needed to complete the processing of a batch and data cap. So the first thing to notice about the Enhanced Flex ID is the way in which pages are displayed. The current implementation of Flex ID displays a 3x3 grid of images and a button is used to advance to the batch. This becomes unfriendly when a big batch with few recognition errors is processed. To deal with this, the Enhanced Flex ID loads each thumbnail into a single scrollable panel. Each page is created individually in the background and this means that no matter how big your batch, you can begin work immediately. So the next thing to notice is our batch view on the right, which is a good way of visualizing all the pages in our group of images. So you can see that it's linked to the flow layout panel on the left, and any individually selected page will scroll into view on the flow layout panel. You can also perform batch reordering directly from the batch view. So on top of the batch view, we have a page type filter, which allows us to single out any page type in the batch for displaying. So this is a good way of visualizing how many problems you have left in your batch. An alternative way of quickly moving through your batch is to use the checkbox called Next Problem located at the top of your tool strip. So this will allow you to tab through all of the page types that have not been correctly identified so far in your batch. This is great for large batches with very few problems with recognition. Two areas of weakness that were identified in the previous FlexID implementation were a lack of hotkey functionality as well as the static nature of the UI. Depending on the specific application as well as the screen resolution of the operator, a different size for both the thumbnails and the preview image may be preferable. In the Enhanced Flex ID solution, this is possible using the trackbar on the left and the splitter between the flow layout panel and the preview image. Enhanced Flex ID not only offers a completely keyable interface to the operator, but also a shortcut configuration window which allows users to select stage, and save their own custom set of key combinations for all the functions offered. All of these settings are stored on a per app and per user basis behind the scenes. And what this means is that as an operator, I can have one set of preferences for each app that I'm operating on. Because this is done behind the scenes, the effect for the user should be a clean and smart user interface. Another feature provided by the Enhanced Flex ID is the ability to correctly display non-image file attachments. Rather than having to work around this by breaking apart your attachments into multiple thumbnails, they can now be correctly displayed as one with a single thumbnail and a single combo box for identification. Enhanced Flex also provides validations where possible. For example, if you attempt to save your batch while there are still unidentified pages remaining, Flex ID will warn you and prevent you from continuing on mistakenly. Thank you for taking the time to listen to this brief overview of the Enhanced Flex ID product by Magic Lamp Software Solutions. Please visit www.magiclampsoftware.net for more.